Uh, this video is an extension to the previous video, which was the Arduino setpoint example. If you haven't viewed that video yet, uh, please do, because a lot of the information that's going to be presented in this video has to do with the previous video. So once again, view the Arduino setup example video before you view this one. In effect, we're going to leave the hardware alone, but we're going to modify the sketch a bit. And let's get to that now. This is our Arduino code. And what we've done is added a few lines to affect the MakerPlot interface screen that wasn't there before. These new additions begin right after the serial begin 9600 baud. And that is we're going to delay two seconds. Then we're going to send out a carriage return, which is just a blank print line. And that's really to clear any data that we might have in the queue. Then we're going to send out a reset command, which is a exclamation point RSET. And then we're going to change the span of the y-axis from what it is on the interface to 0 to 1000. We're further going to change the time span to 180 seconds. We're going to turn the plot on. And then we're going to label the interface as My Arduino Interface. And you'll see that in big red letters right across the top of the plot area. Then going down here to the loop, we're going to additionally add a few lines right under where it says LED state equal 1. If LED state equal 1 because our sensor value uh, exceeded the set point, we're not only going to set the LED to a on condition, but we're also going to print the bell command, which will sound the PC bell, and then delay 500 milliseconds to allow the bell to sound. So while these are very minor changes to our set point example, they do represent what we can do to affect Maker plot directly from your micro. That's very important because we're going to get into much more of these kinds of examples later on, but this gives you a taste of what can be done. All right, let's go to the interface. And this time, let's pick run standard interface. We'll let it load. Now, as soon as I click the rocker switch, that's going to connect to our micro, and it's going to then basically reset the micro code, and uh, we'll be able to see the modifications that we put in. So let's click on it. Wait a second. And there we are. There is my Arduino interface right there at the top, and we're beginning to plot our, um, our set point, which is in red, and our pot value, which is in black at this point. So let's creep up on our set point with our pot. As we cross the set point, we hear our computer bell. Get below the set point, the bell goes away. Get above the set point, and the bell sounds. And also the, the uh, speed of the uh, display uh, is slower, too, because re remember, we're delaying 500 milliseconds every time the bell sounds. So this is a short and sweet example of uh, how we can interact with MakerPlot using commands coming directly from the micro. And once again, we'll be getting much more into these sorts of commands in later videos.